I know a lot of men get horny. Uh, you, you see a big, big, juicy booty and you just want to touch it. However, I believe a lot of men don't think about the consequences of touching the booty. <laughs> they don't think about it, especially when the booty comes like a pre-packaged Happy Meal with children. I'm going to tell you, brothers, um, be extremely cautious when you make that choice of messing with the single mom. A lot of you people are probably thinking you're going to just get in there and get some of that wet goodness and slide on out. But I do not believe that will be the case. A lot of these uh, women don't look at it how you look at it. A man is thinking, hey, we're going to just exchange orgasms. We're going to just get together and have a good time. Where, you know, not that I'm a woman, but she's thinking resources. Somebody help me take care of my kid. And maybe, and just maybe, you know, not all women are like that, but enough of them are. Just maybe another baby daddy and a paycheck that I never have to be around. And a brother got to pay that price all because he wanted to touch the juicy booty. He wanted to squeeze on the big fat donkey. Now, there may be some exceptional women with children. I, I've dated women. I thought it was great that I had some kids when I was younger. But today, um, I just don't see the, the worth. I'm not saying the women aren't worth something, but it's too much hassle. It's going to be, uh, to me, a financial liability because you're going to always have to worry about how her kid is living or, you know, it may be some some puzzle, some conundrum to you achieving your goal of busting that fantastic orgasm. Who wants to deal with that? I don't. I just want to slap you in the booty, baby, and keep it pushing. So, I'm saying this real short, brothers. Um, before you mess with a woman that has a child, uh, think heavily about it. If it's, uh, Listen, I wish they would legalize prostitution because it would make it so much easier for so many of you brothers out there. You wouldn't have to, uh, you know, because a lot of your brothers is not mo one, so you wouldn't have to waste your time trying to figure out if a girl want to give you some um, physical gratification or not. You could just, you know, say, hey, baby, this is what I want, how much it's going to cost. Because trust me, even though people hate to say it, the vagina has a cost now. People say it's subjective, but if we go by the market, supply and demand, uh, it's kind of oversaturated, so the price is not really that high. Now, a lot of people will try to, you know, short, uh, you know, a product, so they they'll try to hold it back to raise the value. But you know, there's other ways for men to achieve that extreme, awesome orgasm. I mean, not that I'm a big advocate, you know, not that I would beat off. <laughs> I do that all the time, but. Uh, you know, sometimes you can just you bust a fat one however you need to do it, and you're going to be good without the wet one for a little while. So, because there are so many ladies, there are a lot. And there are probably a lot of ladies with a big fat one. Be real careful when you mess with one that comes with a big happy meal. You know, I, I, I talked to uh, some brothers the other day, um, and I was asking them, you know, what, what just in general, what would be the limit of um, the number of children would a dude date? You know, some brothers that had kids would say one, some would say two, but it was, you know, myself. And um, I say uh, it's like a 99.9 .9 chance um, that I really won't uh, connect with a woman, like get with her that had a kid. Not, you know, I'm not saying I can. Uh, slide into a happy one night push around and disappear type situation and uh, I, I say 99 because there's always that it's, there's no absolute anything but I'm going to try my best to uh, you know look at it like that you know it, anything can happen you know lightning may strike twice in the same day at the same place at you know who knows so but in general going off of it going back to where I'm going to Brothers, think about it. When you want that big fat booty and you want to get the thing wet and she looks tempting, uh, think about it, man. Um, if that's all you can get, um, you're going to probably give in to your impulse as a man and you're going to dive right in.
like like Kenny Lamar swimming pool. <laughs> Die, man. Not me though. All right, now just try to spread some love. Uh, hope y'all feel great. Think about it real tough before you make that choice. Never rush, because there's always more. Remember that there's always another girl that turns 18 every day. You know, and 18 is legal. Don't let no woman shame you and say, "Oh, you don't mess with that young girl." Hey, if that's what you want to do, brother, and you. 25, you 30, you know, then you do that, you know, that's my end of my statement, I hope uh, people can agree with it, if you disagree, you can always comment on my video, I, and I'd love to address it, it, it'd be funny to me, because uh, a lot of people, to me, do not think logically, and if they make a sound argument, and I can understand your argument, I'm, I promise you, I will consider what you say, and uh, reevaluate my assessment of the situation, all right now, take care, love yourself, love somebody, Stop her on the button, show you how much you love her. All right, take care.